this, I'm pretty glad that you're alone You said she's scared of me, I mean I don't see what she sees, but maybe it's cause I'm wearing your cologne Play. Play is the secret to anti-aging. After nine months of traveling in nine different countries, I come back looking five years younger than when I left. My friend Samuel J has been traveling all over the world performing. Tonight, I'm at his event with his friends, fellow philanthropists, artists, business people from different places and spaces. And that they did find that our program impacted just once a week, the kids were fine. So this is one of like the, the testimonials that I got from the kids. I learned that service takes my mind off of dark thoughts, self-hate, and cravings for drugs. Plant Pals, which is what the program was called originally, makes me feel good about me, and I enjoy Gina and Julia. <laughs> Oh, people said they know me, they've been around They only see the smiles, never see the frowns Only God knows, right? The things I do when I'm alone at night I've been fucking around with the snow white Only want someone to hold me tight When it's cold, and blows and it's 5 a.m. Sleep away the day till the night begins Don't win dead love, storm my friends You'll never know life through my lens Tell me, shut You know, when in doubt, think out. When we are in service, we actually become to play big and feel our business and see ourselves in these roles that are not what we identify with sometimes. Like these kids in addiction and recovery, they're constantly reflecting on themselves as bad, as there's something that's wrong with them. And here they are in a place where they're actually doing something and being a leader, being compassionate, being kind, and getting, seeing them, witnessing themselves in that state. It feels like, just for a moment, and just notice, it doesn't take that long. And just continue to make ourselves stiffer and stiffer by stifling play. And I love this quote, we don't stop playing because we grow old, we grow old because we stop playing. And Two years later, I have about 30 to 100 people dancing with me each week. The Wave is a guided community dance experience held in nature that uses a combination of music, dance therapy, and technology So I surrendered with holy intention, was low and ascended, and to one back to the only, a one never lonely, a one never lonely. The beauty in the brokenness, oh heaven in the hopelessness. I see the music in the static sounds, a rainbow where the cloud is found. We are collectively healing together. From a politically divided nation, tonight we are together, red, blue, white, into the light. In the end, we all come from the same source, love. We are still And tonight, under the full moon, I am reminded who I am, where I come from, and what I am here to do, to be, to become. All right, um, the song is about rain. We need it. I love it. Uh, I met a man from Portugal, and he had a phrase that he would say when he was drinking. Big fan of drinking. Um, <laughs> He would say, so is you, but I am the rain, I am the rain, and you just make it rain. And although that's a little bit different of a vibration. 
I consider all of this on a 14 hour drive. I receive a text message that I waited months to send. It goes on and on and on. It started just like this. Rain falls, rain falls down. Heavenly with the fallen, because we all come from one. Tonight, the moon is full. The yin energy is powerful, and I am integrating the yin. There are three stages of shadow integration. The first stage is faith over fear. 
The second stage is compassion transforming into hope over apathy. And the third component of shadow integration is love over judgment. Love is the last and most critical component to shadow integration. <laughs> 1 Corinthians 13 12 is the mystery of love. It is the key to reversing curses, breaking spells, and setting people free from the bondages of life lies. Similar to how you know, Drew was talking about earlier about the dichotomy of life. Because really, nothing breaks you, you know. It, uh, it breaks you open, you know. And um, the song is dedicated to all of us that have been going through it in recent times. And uh, breaking open to more light. 1 Corinthians 13 12 is the key to spiritual warfare on both sides. day I told a scholar that there are two components to being woke. First, you got to be woke. Then, you have to choose a side.
actually there are three components. Once you choose a side, you'll be training on how to fight in the spiritual realm. If you happen to choose the side of love, then you will train on how to love. Love is the hardest and simplest way. Once you become good at it, you will be like God, knowing good and evil and still acting on good. <laughs> 